Martin. Nine News reporter Bryce Onslinger is in the newsroom to explain. Bryce? Well, Julie, it's been a long 18 months for the family of Kaysen Schrock. The eight-year-old was almost killed when he was hit by a falling tree last April, but he's making progress one step at a time. C-A-S-E-N, The Rock! The Campbell County High School cheerleaders did more than just cheer on their team tonight. They cheered for a little boy who was almost taken from his family much too soon. We got you. Kaysen Schrock rode onto the field with his dad as the older kids he looks up to chanted his name. Let's go, Kaysen! While the players fought for yards on the field, Kaysen showed the crowd what he's been fighting for, the ability to walk. Were there times when you didn't know if he'd, he'd be even walking like he was tonight? Several times, many times <laughs> throughout the weeks and months, and uh, he just continues to surprise us, and we just keep moving on. Kaysen loves sports and played baseball before his accident. This is what Kaysen looked like three days after he was hit by a falling 60 foot pine tree outside of his home. His parents say the young man has worked hard to get where he is today. I definitely can say that it's been a long journey to this point, and tonight was just a night full of pride. His family says he couldn't have done it without the support of the people of Alexandria and Campbell County. I think he looks at everybody uh, around him and, and just realizes that I want to be like that again. And Kaysen still has a long road to recovery, but his family is confident he'll continue to make strides and one day live a normal life. Julie?